Hello, welcome to Scholastic Challenge. Scholastic Challenge is a quick recall academic competition for students from area high schools. My name is Jacqueline Hawkins and I'll be your moderator today. Our judge is Malia Mattingly. Even though our teams are familiar with the rules, I would like to state that although Scholastic Challenge is similar to Governor's Cup, it is a Hardin County Schools competition. Today's contestants are from John Hardin High School and Meade County High School. Now let's meet the team members and sponsors from John Hardin High School. Sydney Martin is a freshman at John Hardin High School. She is a member of the academic team and the cross country team. She placed second in arts and humanities at the JV Challenge and first for JV in the Heartland League. When Sydney Martin graduates, she wants to go to college to study forensics or music composition. After that, she plans to work in forensics or write music. Her hobbies include playing and writing music, running and drawing. Gautam Singh is a senior at John Harden High School. He is a member of the academic team, tennis team, and beta club. When Gautam graduates, he plans to attend a four-year university to obtain a degree in engineering. Afterward, he aims to work for a major tech corporation and climb the corporate ladder. In his free time, he likes to watch movies and TV shows, play video games, and build machines. Kyle McCormick is a senior at John Harden High School. He is a member of the academic team, tennis team, and beta club. When he graduates, he plans to attend the University of Louisville and later become a geneticist to hopefully cure genetic diseases. He enjoys procrastinating and regretting it later. <laughs> Ayun Allen is a junior at John Harden High School. She is a member of the academic team, student council, I lead, and Hardin County Teen Corps. When Ayun Allen graduates, she wants to go to the University of Louisville to obtain a degree in political science. After that, she plans to pursue a career in law as she believes she could help advocate for people. Her hobbies include reading, baking, and riding her bike. Becca Justice is an English teacher at John Harden High School. She attends University, she attended the University of Louisville for a bachelor's, University of Cumberland's for both of her master's degrees, and she is currently pursuing her doctorate in education there as well. In her spare time, she enjoys writing novels, reading, painting, and spending time with her husband, dogs, hedgehog, and fish. Raylene McCormick is an instructor three at John Harden High School. She is a coach of the academic team and the tennis team. Her hobbies include trivia, watching sports, and Jeopardy, doing arts and crafts, traveling, and spending time with family. Ms. McCormick has traveled to all 50 states and hopes to get to all national parks in her lifetime. We will now meet the team and sponsors from Meade County High School. Ravea Cruz, daughter of Jeremy and Anna Cruz. She enjoys reading, writing, and spending time with friends. Her future plans are going to college and studying to be a pharmacist. Riley Snyder is a senior at Meade County High School. She is the daughter of Kyle and Dawn Snyder. In her free time, she enjoys playing tennis. Her future plans are to attend some university with a major in international affairs. Jordan is a senior at Meade County High School. He's the son of Jeremy and Iris Stoll. He enjoys playing soccer and tennis and plans to attend the University of Kentucky this fall and eventually go to law school. Sophia Valls is a senior at Meade County High School. She is the daughter of Doug and Melissa Valls. She enjoys reading, crafting, and going to the gym. She plans to attend a liberal arts university and law school. Coaches, you may return to your seats at this time. Contestants, remember that you may interrupt the reading of a toss-up question by buzzing in. However, if your answer is incorrect, the question will be reread in its entirety for the opposing team. Teams may confer on bonus questions, but the team captain must give the response or must designate a respondee. All questions are worth one point and each half is 10 minutes long. Teams, remember that the bounce back bonus will be in effect. If you're ready, let's begin the first half with a toss up question. Toss up. Which French author is considered a pioneer of the science fiction genre for such works as Around the World in 80 Days and From the Earth to the Moon? John Singh. Jules Verne. That's correct. This is a bonus for John Harden. The final velocity of an object was 66 meters per second, and its initial velocity was 26 meters per second. The change was accomplished in four seconds. What was the average acceleration experienced by the object? 
10 meters per second? That's incorrect. Bounce back. 10 meters per second squared. That's correct. <laughs> this is a toss up question. This 1598 decree ended 40 years of strife in France between the Huguenots and Catholics. It gave the Huguenots. <laughs> Meade County Snyder. Edict of Nods. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. What is the derivative of the sine of x? Cosine of x. That's correct. <laughs> Toss up question. In which country would you find deserts like the Great Sandy, the Gibson, and the Great Victoria? Meade County Snyder. Australia. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. Some radioactive nuclei emit particles consisting of two protons and two neutrons. What do we call this particle, which is identical to the helium nucleus? No answer. Bounce back. Alpha decay. That's incorrect. The correct response is alpha particle. Toss up question. Two answers are required. What are the names of the two capital cities that can be found on the island of Hispaniola? Meade County Snyder. Georgetown and Santo Domingo. That's incorrect. The correct responses are Port au Prince and Santo Domingo. Toss up question. What substance, 2.5 times as dense as steel, is used in warheads designed to penetrate the armor of tanks? John Harden McCormick. Tungsten. That's incorrect. Uranium. Toss up question. First and last name required. Which Roman wrote that Gaul was divided into three parts? John Harden Singh. Julius Caesar. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John Harden. Which FX series about a struggling chef snagged awards for outstanding comedy series and outstanding lead actor in a comedy series at the 2024 Primetime Emmy Awards? No answer. Bounce back. I designate Sophia. Fair. That's incorrect. It's called the bear. Toss up question. This native, this American author only completed one novel in his lifetime, the narrative of Arthur Gordon Pym of Nantucket. He's better known for poetic works like A Dream Within a Dream and short fiction like The Mask of the Red Death. Name this author. Edgar Allan Poe. Toss-up question. The velocity of a Learjet is doubled. What happens to its momentum? B County Stoll. It's doubled. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. Which body system is affected by a disorder called croup? Endocrine system. That's incorrect. Bounce back. Gastrointestinal. That's also incorrect. It's the respiratory system. Toss up question. What is the coefficient of the fifth term of the expansion of the quantity x minus 2 to the fifth power? John Harden McCormick. 1. That's incorrect. Meade County Stoll. 20. That's also incorrect, it's 80. Toss up question. What European country governed Palestine under the terms of a 1922 mandate by the League of John Harden Singh? Great Britain. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John Harden. What is the musical term for a one movement orchestral form that develops a poetic idea, suggests a scene, or creates a mood? Claude Debussy's work, Prelude to the Afternoon of a Fawn, is an example of this genre. No answer. Bounce back. Ballad. It's incorrect. It's a symphonic poem or a tone poem. Toss up. 
This former leader of the Africa Corps was in line to be chief of state had the 1944 plot to assassinate Adolf Hitler succeeded, but he was caught and forced to swallow poison. Name this German military hero. John Harden Singh. Rommel. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John Harden. In 1493, Spain and Portugal settled a dispute over newly discovered lands by dividing the New World at what line? I designate I am. Uh, the equator. That's incorrect. Bounce back. I designate Riley. No answer. It's the line of, that's also incorrect, uh, it's the line of demarcation. Toss-up question. Which adjective describes the shape of the orbit of the Earth around the sun? John Harden McCormick. Elliptical. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John Harden. What membrane-bound sacs in many cells are used for storage of proteins and waste chemicals? Phospholipid bilayer? Uh, that's incorrect. Bounce back. Lysosomes? That's also incorrect. Uh, the correct response is vacuoles. <laughs> Toss-up question. The American-born author Henry James lived most of his adult life in which country? Meade County Vowles. England? That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. Cranks convert linear motion to what kind of motion? Rotational? That's correct. This is a toss-up question. A famous nuclear physicist, physicist exiled to Gorky and noted for his hunger strikes was the Soviet Union's only winner of the Nobel Peace Prize. Name him. Andre Sakharov. Toss-up question. What is the limit of the function g of x equals the quantity x squared plus 6x plus 1 over the quantity x minus 3 as x approaches 3? Undefined or infinity? Toss-up question. What country emerged through the Peace of Westphalia in 1648 as continental Europe's dominant power? John Harden Singh. Portugal. That's incorrect. Meade County Snyder. Germany. That's also incorrect. The correct response is France. Toss up. This age began about 10,000 BCE with the Hittites. Name it. John Harden McCormick. Bronze Age. That's incorrect. Meade County Snyder. Copper Age. That's also incorrect. It's the Iron Age. Toss-up question. What kind of biological molecule is the primary component of nucleoli in cells? John Harden Singh. DNA. That's incorrect. <clears throat> it's RNA. Toss-up question. Name the U.S. president who fired Douglas MacArthur from his command in Korea. John Harden Singh. Nixon. That's incorrect. Meade County Stoll. Eisenhower. That's also incorrect. It's Harry Truman. Toss-up question. What is the name for radiation such as gamma rays and x-rays that can remove electrons from atoms? John Harden McCormick. Ionizing. That's correct. Bonus for John Harden. The Kaaba, a temple containing a black rock, is in what city sacred to Islam? Mecca. That's correct. <laughs> Toss up. In the time of Sherlock Holmes, this gentle cleric became English. <laughs> and we won't have time to complete that question. At the conclusion of the first half, the score is tied with John Harden 7, Meade County 7.
During halftime, we like to learn a little bit about the schools that our teams represent. We have a video to tell us about John Harden High School. John Harden High School opened its doors in August of 2001. The students quickly initiated this school competitively, winning competitions during the summer of 2001, and have steadily added more accolades in a multitude of areas as the years have progressed. Drawing students from central Hardin County, John Harden has a student body of over 1,200 and offers a full range of academic and extracurricular activities. Offering eight advanced placement courses and a wide variety of other student interests, John Harden has been represented in local, state, national, and international competition. John Harden High is also the host site of the Hardin County Excel program, which provides needed assistance for young people in completing their high school education. John Harden has always been a student body with a strong sense of school spirit. Having been created from two competing schools, the students of John Harden have rapidly developed a sense of self as the school has grown and have let the surrounding schools come to recognize the growl of a bulldog. John Harden has annually participated in the National Merit Scholars Program and the Governor's School for the Arts, and it is not unusual for the graduating class to receive scholarship offers approaching a total of $1 million or more. In the areas of sports and marching band, John Harden has also grown to a force that must be recognized by other schools. This is exemplified by the fully functioning array of playing and practice fields, including state-of-the-art baseball, basketball, football, softball, soccer, tennis, and track facilities. John Harden High School is proud to house the Harden County Performing Arts Center. The Performing Arts Center hosts a variety of local theatrical and dance companies and provides a venue to bring the arts to Hardin County students and their families. The John Hardin Academic Team is proud to represent such an exemplary scholastic institution. Now, Levi Meadows will tell us about Meade County High School. Meade County High School in Brandenburg, Kentucky is a learning community where every student, every staff member, and every community member is valuable and actively contributes to our goal of excellence in every endeavor. We strive to provide a rich and meaningful learning experience for our students and include a rigorous curriculum that builds both content knowledge and character as well as a wide variety of extracurricular activities to engage every student. We want every one of our graduates to have the foundation that he or she will need to be successful in today's society. Thank you, Levi. Welcome back to the second half of the Scholastic Challenge between John Harden High School and Meade County High School. During the half, we had a substitution for John Harden High School. Story Lowry is joining the team. Story Lowry is a freshman at John Harden High School. They're a member of Beta Club and the academic team. Once they graduate, they'd like to go to LSU and major in biology. Then they'd like to get a job in radio biology. In Lowry's free time, they like studying advanced math and science concepts, as well as foreign languages. They believe that being determined is the best quality a person can have. We also had a substitution for Meade County High School. Paul Slack is joining the team. Paul Slack is a senior at Meade County High School. He is the son of Shannon and Brian Kala. He plans to attend a university and obtain a degree in astrophysics. Teams, let's begin the second half of today's competition with a toss-up question. What is the mass of an object if its speed is 20 meters per second and its kinetic energy is 400 joules? John Harden McCormick. 20. That's incorrect. It's two kilograms. Toss-up question. The following are all characters in what novel by Edith Wharton? Maddie Silver, Ruth Varnum, Ned Hale, and Zenobia Pierce from? Meade County Vowels. The Age of Innocence. That's incorrect. It's Ethan Frum. Toss-up question. The diagonal of a square is 10 feet in length. The length of one side in feet is equal to the square root of what number? Meade County Snyder. 10. That's incorrect. Fifty. Toss-up question. 
From her former colonial empire, France retains the islands of St. Pierre and Miquelon. They lie in the gulf at the mouth of one of North America's major rivers. Name this river. Meade County Snyder. Hudson River. That's incorrect. It's the St. Lawrence River. Toss-up question. This historical French churchman was used as a villain in Alexander... Meade County Snyder. Cardinal Richelieu. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. Which symphonic poem did George Gershwin compose during a 1928 vacation to Europe? I designate Sophia. Rhapsody in Blue. That's incorrect. Bounce back. No answer. The correct response is an American in Paris. Toss up question. In 1961, who was propelled 116 miles into the ionosphere to become America's first man in space? John Harden Singh. Shepard. That's correct. <laughs> Bonus for John Harden. The WSM Barn Dance was originally broadcast from Nashville, Tennessee. Eventually, that program changed its name to what? No answer. Bounce back? No answer. It's the Grand Ole Opry. Toss-up question. As what part of speech are the two infinitive phrases used in this line? To live with him is to learn humility. They're functioning as nouns. Toss-up question. Shariar was emperor of Persia and India. He was convinced of the unfaithfulness of all women and vowed to marry a new woman every day and have her executed the next morning. Who was his last wife? Scheherazade. Toss-up question. While domes were distinctive ceilings in ancient Rome, what type of arched ceilings are distinctive features of Gothic cathedrals? John Harden Singh. Waltz. That's correct. This is a bonus for John Harden. Twilight is briefest on any given day of the year from what named line of latitude? Equator. That's correct. <laughs> Toss up question. What term relates the sizes of opposite angles of an inscribed quadrilateral? Meade County Snyder. Adjacent. That's incorrect. Supplementary. Toss-up question. Convert 50 degrees Celsius to Fahrenheit. Time. The correct response is 122 degrees. Toss up question. Which movie turned musical features songs such as Oh My God, You Guys, So Much Better, and Bend and Snap? Me, County Snyder. Legally Blonde. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. How many states share a common border with Connecticut? Three. That's correct. <laughs> Toss-up question. What Chinese president later served as director of the Kuomintang Party? Meade County Stoll. Mao. That's incorrect. John Harden McCormick. Xi Jinping. That's also incorrect. It's Sun Yat-sen. Toss-up question. Which presidential candidate used the campaign slogan, Will Buckham in 56, to play on his nickname of Old Buck? James Buchanan. Toss-up question. In the Christian church year, Lent begins on what day? Meade County Stoll. Ash Wednesday. That's correct. 
This is a bonus from Meade County. What poetic form did Elizabeth Barrett Browning use for her 1850 collection of 44 love poems? The title of the collection is a reference to the poem's forms and to Robert Browning's nickname for Elizabeth. Sonnet? That's correct. <laughs> Toss-up question. Umbriel is a satellite which orbits around what planet? John Harden Singh. Uranus. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John Harden. Which American League team won the 2023 Baseball World Series? Chicago Cubs. That's incorrect. <laughs> Bounce back. Astros. It's the Texas Rangers. <laughs> Toss-up question. Sines and cosines are never greater than what value? John Harden Singh. One. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John. In what year was the 19th Amendment to the U.S. Constitution ratified? 1929. That's incorrect. Bounce back. I designate Sophia. 1920. That's correct. <laughs> Toss-up question: Which children's author of late 19th century and early 20th of the late 19th and early 20th centuries is known for works such as *The Secret Garden* and *A Little Princess*? Frances Hodgson Burnett. Toss-up question. In Norse mythology, Ratatoskr runs up and down the branches of Yggdrasil to relay messages between the eagles at the top and the serpent Nidhogg at the bottom. What kind of animal is Ratatoskr? John Harden Singh. Squirrel. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John. In which U.S. state can you sled down the tallest sand dune in North America at Great Sand Dunes National Park? California. That's incorrect. Bounce back. Utah. That's also incorrect. It's Colorado. Toss-up question. Toss-up question. Which director of Little Women and Lady Bird was snubbed? <laughs> Meade County Vowles. Gerwig. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for Meade County. In order to foster the rights of this subgroup of the U.S. population, NOW, N-O-W, was formed in 1966. What do the letters NOW represent? National Organization of Women. That's incorrect. Bounce back. National Organization of, I don't know. It's National Organization for Women. Toss up question. Identify the narrow band of easterly flowing winds that average speed, that averages speeds of around 40 miles per hour in summer and 80 miles per hour in winter, but may occasionally have much higher speeds. John Harden Singh. Jet stream. That's correct. <laughs> this is a bonus for John Harden. First and last name answer, please. Identify the science fiction writer who penned the Dragon Riders of Pern. No answer. Bounce back. Robert Smith. It's incorrect. It's Anne McCaffrey. Toss up. Which country music artist? <laughs> At the conclusion of the second half, we have a tie in today's Scholastic Challenge, so we'll go into our tiebreaker. A tiebreaker is the best three out of five of the toss-up questions. There will be no bonuses. Toss-up question. Which country music artist was recognized as Male Vocalist of the Year at the 2023 CMA Awards? Maine County Stoll. Chris Stapleton. That's correct. <laughs> toss-up question. What is the area of a parallelogram whose sides are 16 feet and 12 feet and whose smallest interior angle is 45 degrees? John Harden Singh. 192 feet. That's incorrect. Meade County Stoll. 96 feet. That's also incorrect. It's 96 radical 2 square feet. Toss up. 
What do we call the electrical device which converts alternating current to direct current? John Harden McCormick. Transistor. That's incorrect. Maid County Stoll. Alternator. That's also incorrect. It's a rectifier. Toss-up question. Name the state tree of Wyoming. Maid County Slack. Poplar. That's incorrect. John Harden McCormick. White Oak. That's also incorrect. It's a cottonwood. Toss-up. The world's highest tides occur in the Bay of Fundy. Name one of the Canadian provinces bordered by the Bay of Fundy. Meade County Snyder. British Columbia. That's incorrect. John Harden Singh. Saskatchewan. That's also incorrect. It's New Brunswick or Nova Scotia. And that tiebreaker puts Meade County over the tie with 15 points, and John Harden has 14. Congratulations to both of our teams for a wonderful match today. We hope you'll join us again for the next installment of the Scholastic Challenge. Congrats to our winners, Meade County High School.